There he is. There he goes. Oh, fresh go. off the oh, injury. No. Oh, no. Uh, his arm's all jacked up. Oh, he's right-handed, too. That's a big no. issue right now. Oh, God. If you can, just fill that out. Oh, this is a written exam? You want me to <laughs> you do your... Yeah, maybe you might have to help me with that. Absolutely. Here. Oh, nice. How would you describe your exercise routine? How would I describe my exercise routine? I blast HGH into my ass cheeks and swole up. I just blast a lot of music and my ass cheeks swole up. <laughs> Let it be that! Let it be that! That's better than what you said! Melodic trance, specifically. <laughs> nice. Human growth hormone. HGH. <laughs> what do you like to wear? What do I like to wear while I'm exercising? Uh, I, I always go. I always go... With a flesh-colored bodysuit. With like a flesh-colored bodysuit. And enough bling to establish dominance. And just enough bling to establish dominance. <laughs> wow, he's a kid. He's great. Crazy. Jesus. He's from Staten Island, buddy. We, it's in his blood. You're right. <laughs> um, what have you eaten so far today? Swordfish parm, parmesan. Swordfish parmesan. That's the most unique answer I've ever heard. I've never had swordfish parmesan no. before. Is it good? There's nothing I love more on a hot summer day than some swordfish parm. <laughs> There's nothing I love more on a hot day than swordfish, swordfish parm. parm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How is this normalized? Swordfish or palm on a hot day. He's like, I get that. What do you look for on the label of food products? Uh, I look for the race of the person who made it. I, I just look for the race of the person who made it. <laughs> <laughs> He's not even hesitating. All right, what do you do to increase your level of happiness? Oh, I prank call the elderly. I prank call the elderly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna write exactly that. Good job. Oh, oh, my good God. Job. Good job. Good job. Lord, it, it makes me proud to see yet another Staten Island boy oh, killing it. Killing it on a practical joker. Okay, so the next one we're playing is Product Justice, where we play inventors and we have to pitch our crazy new products to people of a focus group. And the crew members who will be playing this game are Casey Jost versus John Zaluga. Oh, yeah! Powerhouses! <laughs> All right, Casey Zaluga, huh? These are two of our comedy producers going head to head. My money's on Zaluga. He looks like more of a, well, yeah. looks more like a geeky dork. <laughs> Thank you. I don't, I don't favor one over the other. I think either has a chance to win. I, I got Casey in My money's on John the horse face Zaluga. <laughs> I'll tell you right now, that dumb piece of shit's gonna win. I'll tell you. I bet 100 bucks on it. <laughs> the nice thing about a crew special is the, the audience gets to see how you talk to the crew. <laughs> <laughs> We're developers. We have new products that uh, that we've each created, and we want to present them to you today just to get some feedback. John? Uh, yeah, I'll start first. All right, what you got, buddy? This is uh, Blue P. If you take this, it's just one tablet, single use, changes your DNA frequency, and this will give you permanent blue eyes. <laughs> One of the main side effects. One of the main side effects of this, I should mention. You shouldn't have children two years after taking it. You should not have children uh, for two years after taking the product. Questions. <laughs> you can have blue eyes with lenses. You can have blue eyes with lenses, but then you have the discomfort of contact lenses. Nice. Again, it's easier to reverse your DNA. <laughs> it's much easier to just to meddle with your DNA. <laughs> Have you guys considered, I guess, like more of the social impact of this type of product? Well, I, I can tell someone with blue eyes, it's, it's everything's much better. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing against it, but this product has always been a little fishy to me. Like, you can't have kids for two years. <laughs> what will happen if you have kids in those two years? We Smurf kids, we, we call them. Right now, the, the term, we don't have a technical term for it. We're calling them Smurf kids right now. <laughs> All right, well, I'm gonna show my product. All right, this is something I'm, you know, really excited about. Okay, this is Needles the Clown. This is Needles the Clown. This is to give shots to children. Oh my God. <laughs> That's a little scary. It should be scary because the thing is, I think nowadays we're seeing a lot of kids having fears. So when you have a thing like this, you know, <laughs> the kid will often react better. <laughs> react better because, because it's, <laughs> it's not so easy not to laugh, is it? No one here thinks this is horrific. It reminds me of, of Chucky. Well, they haven't heard the voice yet, Casey, so. You guys are judging it now, but like you haven't heard the voice yet. Oh it's what? Well, I'll show you. So imagine it coming down the hallway. <laughs> Children. 